Hello and welcome to another 3D printing video. Today I'll be testing out Hakka's um, 3D wood filament. So first impressions, when I pulled this out of the box, I kind of freaked out because if you can see on the picture, that's white filament that it shows. And I ordered wood. But then I learned that it also says ABS, uh, PLA, and HIPS. And it's, so this is just their generic box for their the company or for their filaments, and you can see that there's wood and wood filament inside there. So I'm going to be testing this out. I'm going to be 3D printing a stump. So yeah, so I kind of freaked out, but it's a it's okay. I mean, it's a box. It's got it's actually pretty cheap filament. I paid eighteen ninety nine for it, so nineteen dollars. And so I'm going to be printing with it and see how well it works. So I'm going to open it up. It is vacuum sealed, which is nice. Woo! It smells like glue. Okay. So it smells like glue. Um, this is my first time buying from Hakka. H-A-C-K-K-A. -K -K -A is how it's spelled. And it really does feel like wood. So what wood filament is, it isn't a vine, or a grind up wood into really teeny pieces and put it into the filament. So this is actually PLA filament with um, wood particles in it, and that's how they, they make um, filaments, different stuff like carbon filament, they put bits of carbon in it, the glow-in-the-dark stuff, they have teeny bits of glow-in-the-dark, and um, just all kinds of stuff. I, oh yeah, there's random things that they do. So. I'm going to be trying this out. I'm going to be 3D printing a stump that I uh, remixed to make it just a stump. It was a stump pencil holder. Um, so I'm going to test this out and see how well it works. It also says in the bottom, um, seal normal temperature and keep away from light. Okay, so it doesn't actually give me a temperature to do. But since it is, um, it says it's PLA, I'll do 200 degrees Celsius to start it off and see how that works. And I'm not going to heat the, the build plate at all and hope it works out good. So, hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so the 3D print got done, and here it is. Oh yeah. That's really cool. I thought it would be appropriate to 3D print a stump with my new wood filament. And so... So I noticed there was a lot of stringing. So while it was going, if you can see the layers of it, you can see there's a spot like right there, like right along there, that's a little bit lighter color. So what I did is I changed it to the temperature to two, 220 degrees Celsius during that point, and then changed it back as soon as you see the layering stop to um, 190 degrees Celsius. So what it did is it made it a little bit less quality, there's a little bit like teeny holes in it. And then once they changed it to a lower temperature, it went back again. I was testing to see if it would burn the wood or anything, maybe make it darker, but it didn't. Um, so I tested that out. Um, it is it is regular PLA. It doesn't, doesn't smell a lot like wood while it was printing, but it was pretty good, especially for the price. It was $19, and they they're normally like $30 to $35 for the cheap ones, I think. I haven't checked, I, have, I don't really look at much expensive filament. I like the cheap stuff because I guess it, it works fine. This one worked great. I was really excited about this. Um, yeah, so if you like this video, um, give this a like. Um, yeah, if you like 3D printing videos, like to see more like stuff like this, or 3D printing gadgets with different types, testing out different types of filament, um, subscribe to my channel. 
and of course leave a comment I guess um, what film you'd like me to try out next and I might check it out uh, thanks for watching bye